Hi guys, it's me, Vani, and welcome back to my channel, Ascending Raven. So, today we have the Witch's Roots unboxing. We got, or I got, the Witch's Roots and the Witch's Moon box today. So we're going to do two videos for the unboxing. We're going to start off with the Witch's Roots. And just so you all know, this is October 2020 unboxing. Um, this is the month that we all look forward to for the entire year. This is the this is the month, October. This is salmon, this is Halloween, this is the veil is thin, this is our time of the year. So I'm really excited to see what all of our boxes this month, um, what we have in store with all of them. So with that being said, the Witch's Roots, I'm going to do a little bit of a switch over. The Witch's Roots is a subscription, monthly subscription. It's $29 a month, um, and we get a lot of goodies, way more than it's the value is just, it's awesome. So I'm going to do this quick, <coughs> excuse me, transformation. This is the box. And this is what it looks like. <clears throat> Sorry, my throat started itching. Okay, so I'm going to take this box out of the frame so that I can show you individually. So we're going to start off with our little paper. This is what we get every month. It's our, it's our um, introduction. It's what we get in the box. Um, it's always wrapped in twine with parchment paper. And it says, The Guided Seer. During this beautiful season of reconnection, deep traveling, and divination, we work towards having helpful tools by us uh, close by to assist us during these dark and most spiritual nights. As Salmon approaches, we begin to obtain a heightened sense of, of self and spirit, knowing that the veil is thinning. As we walk between the worlds, we connect with our ancestors, spirit guides, and divine energies, leaning into any guidance, protection, or symbols that may be, that may be received. This time, of, in, this time is sacred and must be treated with sincerity. It is important to know that the ritual work that is conducted during this season can have a profound impact on your current reality and provide you with the clear perception on what may be approaching you on the horizon. We send energies of growth and connection during this coming dark nights and have included the following tools to help you along your way. Uh, may you speak with those that, s that stand by to guide you. May you resonate with the, fa with the faintest of whispers. May your cup be filled with further wisdom so that you prosper on the path ahead. The magical in this item, the magical items in this box are as followed, and you guys know I don't want to read it. All right, let's see. That's the first thing. Well, you know what I'll do is I will leave this right there, just for reference. Just for reference. Next, we have this. Oh, what is this thing called? Um. Um. Oh, God, why can't I remember it? I have a bracelet with that. Um, the Hand of Fatima. Um, the, okay, what does it say, though? Um, hand? I think that says hand. I think. Oh, this is Hand of Miriam? Moses' sister, Hand of Fatima. Yeah, the Hand of Fatima. The Hand of Mary, the Hand of Venus. Oh, I didn't know that she has the... I didn't know it had different names. Um, there's the Evil Eye right here. Um, this is beautiful. That's... Uh, you know what? I might... I don't know. That's beautiful. I really, really like that. Okay, we'll put that there. Next we have... Um, motherwort, uh, 
I can't even read this font. And then I'm wearing my contacts, so that's even worse. Like, all right. I have enough, I do enough, I am enough. The element of earth and water, celestial influence is Saturn, Moon, and Venus. Um, I can't even read this tiny herbs of, I can't, I'm sorry guys, I just can't try to get that out of the glare. Can't read that. I'll put that one right there. Next, okay, so then that was on top, and then this is what we have. We get to dig deep, and you guys know, like I always say, I haven't peaked. I don't know the theme. I don't know anything about this month. I just look so forward to October. Okay, so we have, first, we have this. Get these little popcornies. Um, salmon. It's salmon oil. Wait, how do we do that? Yeah, there you go. Let's see. Okay, let's see what this smells like. I definitely smell vanilla in here. I smell cinnamon, vanilla, I think the vanilla is overpowering everything. Oh, but it makes you just want sweets. Mmm. It's very, very sweet scent. Very, very sweet scent. It's beautiful. Okay, then we have that. Well, let's cable that stay. Okay. Next, we have our little sachet with a stone. get a little bit closer oh this is opalite I don't know if you guys can see the iridescence of this it's like it, that's definitely opalite let me see is it in here oh it's aura rose quartz although you may only think that salmon may provide a night of connection with ancestors and guides we commonly find uh, we find that we find deep healing within each practice and ritual we have included a tumbled aura rose quartz to keep you with your with your place among your altar during this time to enhance healing and gentle energies take the time to feel the energy held within this stone and it's outer coating. It's outer coating. Elemental connection is water. Hmm. That's really pretty. I don't know. Can you guys? I don't, uh, I don't think so. It has like an iridescent. Um, I guess it's a coating. I don't know. I've never heard of aura rose quartz. Oh. Okay, we have a little token. Man, you witches roots people. Look at that. This is the goddess and she, right, I don't know if you guys can see it. Let me see, can you guys see it? I don't know, I don't know if you can, but let me see. I don't think it's going to show. Okay, so right here, it's the goddess symbol, the mother maiden in chrome. Ugh, crone. Ugh. But that is beautiful, and it's like, oh, dream. Oh, that's so pretty. That I wish was a necklace. Okay, next we have our candle. I'm so delicate, I'm light with these candles. <laughs> oh, this purple candle. Oh, good Lord. I smell something on there, but it might be that, you know, we always get an incense. Oh, that smells so good. And it's, I love, 
That is my favorite color of all times. That eggplant grape color. Mm -hmm. Okay. Motherwort. That's our um, book of shadows. I honestly have never heard of motherwort, but let's see. I know mugwort, but let's see. Um, okay, motherwort herbal grimoire artwork. Motherwort, an appropriate herb to work with during salmon. Motherwork is an ancestral plant and it's known and recognized for its wonderful magical properties by many cultures and religions from around the world. From Celtic, to Celtic traditions to Santeria practice throughout Central and South America, as we work to connect the ancestors and guides during these nights, Motherwort is a stable companion, providing relief to those that suffer from a sense of loneliness or disconnection. Motherwort allows you safe passage as you correspond with the divine energies and perform divinationary practices. For those that may feel vulnerable during this time, motherwort is a great ambulance against bad luck and protects against evil or ill intent spirits, keeping them away as you focus on your rituals or meditations. Motherwort purifies any sacred space and often is found within magical bath salts, blends, and ritual oils used for washing away stagnant and irrelevant energies. Use this herbs in dressing your candles, bath salt, elixirs, or simply allowing them to place in a bowl on your altar. Take the time to breathe in energies associated with this herb, allowing yourself to understand how you connect with its properties on its personal and spiritual level. You are often surprised at signs we received in the working, from working to connect with our own meaning of different herbs, barks, and roots. May Mother Work protect you on your journey ahead, allowing you peace of mind and security during the dark half of the year. Elemental is Earth, Water Planetary, Connections, Saturn, Moon, and Venus. I want to know why I have never heard of Mother Work. Um, I have literally never heard of that, and now... I'm going to have to get me a bit of a batch of that because I didn't know about that. Okay. Oh, now we have this. Do we have another little pendulum? We have a pendulum. How do I, where did I get that? Yep. We have a pendulum. Oh. I love tarot. I love Lenormand. I really, I love charms. I love any kind of divination. But for some reason, I cannot connect with the pendulum. And I want to so bad. I want to do the pendulum so bad because you have no idea how much I lose stuff. And I would love to use this to find my stuff. Oh, but that is so pretty. Oh, okay. Well, it is what it is. Okay, last but not least, we have... Our incense. Oh, that smells like frankincense or something. Hold on. Sanctuary ritual incense sticks. The wonderfully aromatic ritual scent sticks were placed within this collection to bring a sense of calm and tranquility into your space as you allow the smoke from the incense to waft throughout your area. Take a deep, intentional breath, allowing yourself to focus on the sacred task ahead of you. There you go, guys. There is our October Witch's Roots. 
Um, my favorite thing is definite. Oh, I don't know. I was gonna say the little um, goddess charm, but I don't know that motherwort. I think I gotta say the motherwort is my favorite for sure. I wonder if it smells like anything. Oh, it smells so bad. Oh, oh my God. It smells so bad. It smells like manure. <laughs> Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys. There you go. There's our October box. I'm going to switch back over here. Okay. There's our October Witch's Roots box. That was funny because I was not expecting that. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know if this was your first box. I'm really curious to see if you are satisfied with this box. I am always satisfied for $25. You can't, I mean, the, honestly, you can't even get, like, maybe you can get the pendulum for 20 bucks, 25 bucks. But with the with the herb, the incense, this beautiful little charm, um, definitely the, be the beeswax candle, the oil, and the artwork, and the information that they provide, because the information that they provide in itself is worth, is worth something. It's, like, valuable. Because, I mean, I'm telling you, like, I'm learning so much from this. I had no idea that there was a motherwort. And I, like, honestly, every month I learn something from these boxes. So it's, like, really exciting. Anyway, guys, I hope you have a beautiful day. Stay safe. Stay clean. Wash your hands. And stay away from people with COVID. <laughs> Talk to you later. Bye-bye.